I am Sister Ann Shank, a sister of St. Joseph of Toronto. While I was running the refugee center, I was asked by the Catholic Immigration Bureau to visit a Somalian lady. There were four children over in the corner in front of a 12-inch television. There was nothing else in the room. And in the kitchen on the counter, there were a couple small plates. There was some scattering of spoons and forks. And I think there was a frying pan. I knew that I couldn't cook a meal for myself with that. And it, it went deep inside me that I needed to start a furniture bank. When people began to hear about Furniture Bank and that we would pick up their gently used furniture, they were so willing to help. They wanted to. We walk around the warehouse. They choose. They want this sofa, not that one, not that one. They want this table with these chairs. They can shop. They're allowed to shop. And it's wonderful when they find something that they love. We need help just financially. Keeping eight trucks on the road and keeping maintaining a warehouse the size that we require now. Just rent alone is over 20000 a month. So that really is a challenge. It, it's really a challenge. I think it's so important because an apartment's not a home. How can people lift their heads up and walk with dignity and self-assurance? How do teenagers live in an apartment where there's nothing, no furniture to sit on? They can't even invite their friends in. To my mind, if, if we're welcoming people to Canada, we have to treat them with respect and give them the option of living with respect and dignity. We need people who will spread the good word <laughs> around the city of about our needs. Thank mm -hmm. you.